In this video, we'll be going over creating a new web application using Spring Boot and Gradle. This is part of a multi-part video series with the objective of creating an e-commerce application using the microservices architecture. This web application that we build today will be the starting block of a microservice which is called the catalog service. This is one of the numerous modules that we'll have to build to eventually build a complete e-commerce application. So let's get going with building a web application using Spring Boot and Gradle. I have my Gradle application created here. Remember all this source code which we discuss in these videos will be available in the GitHub repository under the organization microaccess demo. So the one that we are discussing today is available under the repository catalog service. So this is my build.gradle file. The key point of interest here is the Spring Boot Starter Web dependency, which will enable us to build the Spring Boot based web application easily. We also have added a dependency to our build script, which is the Spring Boot Gradle plugin, which will help us run the Spring Boot application using Gradle. Here we apply a plugin called Org Spring Framework Boot, which comes from this plugin that we've included. That's all that we have in this uh, builder Gradle file. Now let's get into the source code for this application. I have, have, I have a catalog server class. All it has is a main method, which asks the Spring Boot to run this application. I have a Spring Boot to scan this package for my Spring Beans. I don't have anything right now. All I have in this package or in this entire source code now is this main class or a catalog server with a main method in it. So that's the base framework for this web application. I haven't added any functionality to it, no features added yet, but as a first step, we'll see this in action. What we expect to see is a web application running in some container. So let's go ahead, go ahead and build this application and run it. Okay, so I use Gradle build to just build this application. It got built successfully. Now I use Gradle boot run. The boot run command comes from the Gradle Spring Boot plugin that we imported. So Gradle boot run is expected to run the application. It reboots the application and it launches the Spring Boot web application. So what do we see here? It launched Spring Boot. It's starting catalog server. What is catalog server? It's basically a Tomcat running on port 8080. So let's verify this. Go to your browser. Localhost 8080. Here we go. We have an error page, a 404, which is as expected, because we haven't added any controls, any pages to this web application. So that completes the first building block towards building the catalog service microservice, that is to create a web application and have it running in, a, in an application server or a container. Stay tuned for the next video where we'll build further on this microservice.
Thanks for watching. Bye.